Uh, thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President, I ask that you also extend uh, courtesies of the Senate uh, to a special guest that we have. We have the Consular General uh, Nassim Abagad, uh, who is from uh, <laughs> Azerbaijan. And uh, the General Council, uh, uh, the Consul General is a uh, representative of his government here in the or in uh, in LA, representing uh, his country in uh, 12 different states, including Oregon. Uh, it should be noted that uh, through the uh, diplomatic services that he has provided for, he has been in our country for uh, for a number of years, uh, serving his country in D.C. before uh, being assigned for. Uh, the last four years in uh, out of LA for the Western states. He also has been in the uh, uh, assemblies of the Australia, Australia, uh, Germany, and has, has uh, brought forward a message that I think is very important for us to keep in mind. Uh, the community or the nation itself is a uh, uh, one that is a uh, few secular countries in the uh, uh, Middle East that has a, a predominantly Muslim population, but maintains very close ties and friend, uh, friendly ties with the uh, state of Israel. Uh, the uh, very proclamation honoring the traditions of the interfaith tolerance, uh, inclusions, and harmony of Azerbaijan. And we think it's very important for those members that are here who would like to uh, participate in signing the proclamation. We do have it here on the floor. Uh, but I would ask you at this time, uh, Mr. President, I believe you may have already had the opportunity to meet uh, the Counselor General, but if you could give him official courtesies, that would be wonderful. Yes, to our friends from the Azerbaijan that are here, Council General and I met, as well as his associate assistant were here yesterday. I don't know if they're in the side aisle where they're, oh, there they are. There he is, right back there. I've already met them, spent some time within my office, extended courtesies and gave them two, some tokens, which I hope they appreciate and respect. We had a nice conversation. They gave me a book that I need to read to learn more about their, where you're from. Honor and privilege to have you on the state Senate floor. I hope you're enjoying your stay in the state of Oregon. Welcome, and I hope you'll stay here for a long time. Maybe one day we'll get a chance to visit you in your country. Thank you, Your Honor.